Temple University is celebrating the life and legacy of Lou Klein. The broadcast pioneer died last month. Klein helped produce landmark television and spent more than six decades teaching at Temple University. Eyewitness News reporter Dan Koob is live on campus. Dan, good evening. Joe, good evening to you. Lou Klein, of course, was a titan of media in the city of Philadelphia, and those who knew him best had a chance to gather here at Temple University to share his story. Lou Klein's reach knew no bounds in Philadelphia, connecting and mentoring people throughout the broadcast industry as he helped define a new communicative path. And the dynamism of his career, the people he affected, whether it was kids, police officers, uh, broadcasters, journalists, Ad, ad people. Uh, he never ever forgot where he came from. All the people that he helped, all of his friends there, I know and I I know how you must be feeling right now because I feel a, a, a huge loss and someone that I, I truly loved. When it came to naming Temple School of Communications after Klein, the decision was easy. There's really only one person for whom this school ought to be named and I'm looking at him. He grinned. And then I said, but I can't do it for free. <laughs> His wife and teammate in life, Janet, summed up Klein's life and impact. And Lou belonged to all of you, simply as he was. He told me that you all were additions to his life. Despite all of Lou Klein's accomplishments, his son Steven said today he was just dead. And that's the way that Lou Klein liked it. Live at Temple University, Dan Koob, CBS3 Eyewitness News. A fitting tribute, Dan. Thank you for that report.